Hello everybody, my name is Philip and I'm the founder and CEO of Foodspring. So let me kick this off with a question. Think about sports nutrition. What is the first thing that comes to your mind? Probably it's these huge black plastic canisters with uh, protein powder of uncertain origin inside and naked all oil bodybuilders um, with veins about to explode on the outside. Well, uh, we believe today's maturity isn't really attracted by these kind of products and the corresponding marketing. So, reality is people want to look good, be fit and feel healthy in a much more natural way. That's why we started Foodspring, the first functional food brand that is really for this new generation. Um, high quality, innovative uh, products that are easy to use and taste great. So let's dive a bit deeper in how we approach things. First, e-commerce. Mm, e-commerce basically changed the way we buy products and how they are shipped. Well, we changed the product itself plus the whole customer experience surrounding it. 10 years ago, e-commerce was a um, quite brilliant and quite disruptive business model. The future, though, lays in brands. Mm, what we believe in is to have a long-lasting customer relationship, to really have a high customer loyalty and basically to um, have a cost and a quality advantage through cutting out the middleman. Second, direct to consumer is key, at least in the beginning. Access to um, direct and unfiltered feedback is priceless, especially as a new brand. That's why we currently only sell through our own website and strive to own all touch points. Third, data. We see ourselves as a food tech company and we are heavily relying on data. Mm. As a food tech company, we really kind of push the envelope a bit further. Basically, the direct-to-consumer approach opened the door to large-scale data collection. So what we do basically is, first, we have an in-house customer service. It doesn't sound too special, but we only work with ecotrophologists to make sure consultation is on point. Additionally, we develop the body check, which is an innovative product finder. Uh, basically, you enter some data about yourself, so your stats, how you train, eat, sleep, and the algorithm recommends the perfect set of products for your goal. At this moment, we have over 500,000 completed body checks. Obviously, this data is invaluable for us. Um, yet, food tech is not only about um, collecting data, it's also about bringing those data to use. Um, which brings me to fourth. Innovation and quality is really the cornerstone of what we do. 10 scientists in our in-house R&D department work on developing the most revolutionary food. Uh, this kind of resulted in a few really interesting products. For example, we are the first to launch an um, organic protein powder in Germany. Um, another example is we have a product called Crunchy Fruits that is um, vacuum dried with a patented process that retains 80% of the vitamins in the product. Or lastly, uh, soy, something that normally is more kind of connected with Asia, is something we cultivated in Germany in organic quality and obviously GMO free. Further, we de-oil it to make it taste better and to make it more tolerable for the, for the body. So, um, Again, food tech for us is something we really strong believe in and something also we want to push further. 
All right, a few numbers. So over 250,000 orders and more than 18 million euros in revenue in our third year. 400% growth year over year and um, a special KPI we actually use internally, which is um, product sales within 24 hours after the launch of a new product. And the last product launch was Protein Bars, uh, which sold over 10,000 units in 24 hours uh, with some additional pre-launch hype, like customers calling our customer service to try to find out some, some hints, or even people showing up at our office. Um, to, to get, get a hand of our products. So, thank you so much, and feel free to get in touch.